If I could say one thing about the real heroes of the uh, country, which I believe are the teachers, you know? Um, I don't really, I don't believe they're the real heroes. That's it. I just spoke again. I actually, I think the real heroes are the real heroes. They get good press because, because people often say to me, you know who the real heroes are? I go, are they the real heroes? They go, no. I go, oh, they're the teachers. It's, it's counterintuitive that it doesn't seem like a heroic job, but yes. <laughs> First of all, if you're a teacher, you get the same fucking vacations as a child. You get like, like four months a year off. You know? <laughs> My vacation? I get I, almost no time off. Over 48 weeks a year. Like four weeks a year I get off. What about you? You're not one of those fucking teachers, right? <laughs> like a teacher. <laughs> now, are you a teacher? Right. What do you teach? What grade? High school. What grade? What, what grade? <laughs> no, but what grade? <laughs> Not so uh, easy when it's the other way around. <laughs> <laughs> it's always easy to ask the questions. <laughs> <laughs> well, the real heroes are the fucking students. <laughs> Have to answer the question. <laughs> <laughs> now, what grade, what grade do you teach? Nine through twelve. Nine through twelve. So you need a grade thirteen education. <laughs> now, you're, now you're the real hero. Now you're the real hero. No, I'm just kidding. You're the real hero. <laughs> Her husband said, you're not the real hero. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> right now, it's a fun thing to say. But what do you do? What do you do for a living that, that your wife's the real hero? <laughs> what? You know, you know you're not the actual real hero, don't you? You look obsessed. <laughs> Did you see how upset she is? So you actually feel you're the real hero? See, I think you've disqualified yourself a little. Because I believe real heroes don't think they are. She says, when you hear the real heroes, they go, how the fuck did you run into that fucking fire and pull a guy out? You're a hero. And they go, no, it's the teachers. Me. I'm a little scared now. I gotta go lie down. Gotta pull the guy out of a fire. <laughs> That's a good job. Come on. Everybody's shorter than you. Are you work with? They have to do whatever the fuck is that. No, I'm sorry. What did you do? What? What? Oh. fuck more students than
actually fought more students, if you can believe this, than priests. You know how priests... priests are the real heroes. <laughs> and yet actual priests, who I know, I'm not, uh, I'm not, uh, uh, I'm not a Catholic, but um, I know pastors, you know, and my God, they, they, most of them that I know do the Lord's work, you know, I mean, they go out and they're in hospitals and stuff and they're doing stuff and for no money, you know, and no recognition, and it's got to kill them, like, going, yeah, people think, uh, fuck kids. <laughs> Like, if I was a priest, man, I'd just let it be known. Like, I'd, I'd do a TV commercial. I'd go, hey, listen, I'm Father Norm here. Run out of my church. I won't fuck your kid. I'll tell you that. That's the first thing I promise you. I'll tell you a little something about myself. I'm Father Norm, as I've told you. And, uh, 20 years or so ago, I took a vow of chastity. Now, what that means is I cannot have sex with a lady, you know? Now that's tough, because I like ladies, and especially the ones, you ever see those ones where they uh, press their tits together, kind of, they got a little cleavage on, but they look kind of hoary, but it looks like they don't know they're whores. <laughs> anyway, that's my type, everybody has their own type. The point is, I don't even fuck them, let alone a child, for that sake. Why would I want to fuck a child? So anyways, but now to Father Norris. <laughs> but I will not fuck your kid. And you can leave your big titted whore wife at home. I, I don't need that to fuck your woman hanging around and asking me questions all the time. It's a junkie. You gotta admit though, the guy that put that flag in the Iwo Jima, he's close. <laughs> spacecraft and crash or there'd be moon aliens or shit like that. <laughs> I mean, uh, I know he's not, I know it's not grade 11 biology, but uh, I mean, it's something. It's something. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> imagine any fucking other fucking job, you know, you go, hey, I'm the civil servant, I'm a hero, you know, you're fucking retarded, but a teacher, <laughs> memorize this shit, <laughs> Tomorrow, and then you gotta tell it to me. Remember, I remember everything I say and then you repeat it to me. I got some problems for you. I know you're a child and that you don't have any problems. That's the cool thing about being a child, but guess what? You fucking got some now. I kind of got some heroic work to do. I'm sure you're a nice lady. Very, very heroic. But, uh, listen, guys. Guys. Here's the problem for a In science, do you teach, do you teach Newton? Isaac Newton? You know, what are you, retard? <laughs> Isaac Newton? Let me find it. The hero that called me is a retard is actually a retard himself. Look at his turn on his elbow. I'm sorry, what? 
A treadmill? Have I seen one? Oh. Wait, I don't even get it. It's not good when people are groaning and I don't understand it. No, have I, have I ever seen a treadmill? Yes, of course. You mean the things you walk on? Yeah, I've seen it millions of times. Yeah, they're here with your walk on them. They're, they're in gyms and they go, no, they're not a, that's not a treadmill? You remind me of these fucking teachers I used to have. I said, yeah, I said, nah. I thought it was it, nah. I'm pretty sure I have seen a treadmill, no matter what you say. It's a thing you walk on and then, right? You're not, what? You wouldn't be sure that I'd seen a treadmill? Well, you see, this is, you're probably very bad at grading people. <laughs> at some, some point, when you ask a student a question, and they give you an answer, you have to take them on faith. <laughs> well, there'd be no motive for me to lie about that question. <laughs> I've seen dozens, hundreds, hundreds of them. <laughs> I don't want to brag, but you know, I don't know. <laughs> I've been around. I've seen fire and I've seen rain. I've seen treadmills and you know what you understand. Baby, I don't think I ever see you.